I'm a little late, but I'm finally ready to show you how to do the email signature tutorial. First tab you're gonna wanna open is canva.com. Create a design, logo. Come over here and click elements. And then I'm gonna type in boho. If you see the little crown, that means you have to have the pro account. So I'm just gonna insert this one. So I just drag it over. Next, I'm gonna enter a text box. I'm just gonna keep it simple and use the steak night font lower the font size. I'm going to put third grade teacher, go stars. So I'm going to go in and see if I can change the spacing of the lines by just highlighting it, going up to here and decreasing the line spacing. So now I'm just going to play around with it and see where I like the font. And there we go. So it starts to get tricky when you want to add in your photo and remove the background backspace. So it deletes. And then I'm going to go into my photos. Now you want to open up PowerPoint but you just open up a blank presentation. You wanna delete these text box. Then you go to insert pictures. Once you insert the photo, it'll automatically take you to the format tab and you wanna go the whole way to the left where it says remove background. As you can see, it kinda of already did it for me, but I think I wanna keep this arm in cause that would look a little weird if I only had one arm. I'm go over here and click mark areas to keep and click on my arm and click keep changes. Now, all you wanna do is just copy and paste the image. So on my keyboard, I'm gonna hit Control and C. Back to my Canva tab and hit Control V. And now I'm just gonna mess with it and resize it a little bit. Okay, let's say I love this. I'm gonna go to share, scroll down, hit download. So I'm going to open it but as you can see, it saves it really big and you want your email signature to only be a banner. So I'm going to click on edit the image and then I'm just going to crop it so it is more rectangular and say you want to go to whatever email you want to add it for. So you click on settings and then you want to click see all settings and you want to scroll the whole way down until it says signature. Click on this little image button and go to upload, select a file from your device. This was the new email, so I'm going to open it. There it is. That's way too big, so I'm going to click on it. And usually I do medium. There we go. I'm going to go down here and make sure that you have your settings signatures on. So for new emails, you want to hit that drop down and you want to hit signature. Hold down and hit save changes. 